All right, good day there, BBPN. Once again, we are on to match two of what apparently is a triple header today. Good Lord. Well, the things we do for money in this league, I swear. Isn't that right, Panda? All right, we're going to the BBPN Exchange League for this one here. As you might have heard, they are in the middle of their playoffs, of all things. And right now, things have gotten pretty crazy. And then again, isn't everything in this bloody league? All right, let's get started with this one. All right, thank you there. Cool split. Let's have a good flip here because life is about to get really interesting. All right, here we go. This is one of the great playoff matches you are about to see some priceless fun here. Yep, everyone's BVP yet on this one here. This is the Exchange League. Fun fact, Exchange League does work a wee bit differently than the regular leagues. Simple fact is, of course, you've got everyone is playing humans, nothing more. However, how it works is inducements not allowed it's all the market. Market determines what does what. All right. So no one's got any inducements here. It is strictly you trade, you build up your team, and at the end of every season there, you trade and bid, and you can only protect certain players. All right. Well, there should be a juicy death there somewhere. That's good. Someone's going to work on it there. Taking a look here. Yeah. Four re-rolls. He's got a Apothecary. He's got no fame. For some reason, they're all turning for this one. The twin-tailed comets here. And you can see here, that is a lot of crazy, absolutely insane skills on the field. All right, let's get this one started. There's the solid kick. All right, and yes, of course, the power kick off return. He is off and running, trying to find his balls. And yes, they get a free reroll, not that they need one. <laughs> well, it is true, not that he needs one. So, yes. Twin Tail Comets have got five rerolls for the first half. What could possibly go wrong? Look at the crazy skills. Double strength increase here. Double agility increase. See, this is why it's such a crazy league. It really is. And later, you got to remember, a team like this can only protect three of the players. And then the rest is all bidding wars. So it gets rather interesting. All right, let's get started with a good solid fisting on the front line there. As you can see, it is an awful lot of skills. Crazy, isn't it? All right, we'll turn those off for a bit because we can't see the players. You've all skilled too well, you bloody bastards. All right, here we go. Charges in, gets the solid fist right into his goblet. Does he get anything? Yes, he does. Oh, my. Well, he's a bit more pleased with that result. That's what he wanted to get. It's KO, not a death, unfortunately. You have to work on that. Now, we do note here, Riverdale does have three reserves. Twintail only have one. So, mind you, while it might be looking pretty grim here, because he's got all the crazy skills, we'll bring those back up for you again. However, oh dear, you don't know how to pick up your balls, do you? Crap! Oh, well, he gets it on the re-roll. Not, not that he's got plenty, but he does make the easy, easy throw. Damn, I'm good. That was his idea. All right, now, River Shots. River Dale Ball Shots in day. They've got lots of ideas. Yes, as you can see, a Blodge Ogre. You might not be able to do much, but man, he's hard to knock down. Of course, that's what his wife said last night. Not from lack of trying to knock him over. Now, would you? Now, all the skills don't ball out. You know, it's better than Veronica. Well, I understand they're part of the cheerleading squad. Not really. I do understand. I did take a look. They were there somewhere. Yeah, they're in there somewhere. Okay. All right, here we go. Double skulls. What a great way to start your game. Yeah, turn one, first block, double skulls. Yeah, it's early a push, though, unfortunately. So that means, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's a blodger. The, yep, the ogre is a blodger. Good grief, indeed. Twin tail comments, though. As you can see, though, they do have a plethora. That's the right word for it. A absolute gun load plethora of skills, uh, especially start increases. As they consider themselves, they are the mutants of the Exchange League. All right, he's offered wrong. It is interesting who he gave it to. You got it right. It's a strength five human. It is Zorg personified, pretty much. 
Well, he's got the basic skills. The only thing he doesn't have is the AG decrease, and he actually still has all his movement. That's rather impressive for the young lad. Now he just needs an armor increase. That's the plan for him. Ah, double skulls on the other side. Yep, Duffle is not liking either the man. He's KO'd. Woohoo! Silence! I kill you! Yeah, I know. Cool's not too happy about that one. <laughs> so, yep, KO's himself. Hey, look at this, he's starting with five re-rolls, he's already down two. Nuffle doesn't like either team. And that's what we like to see here on the broadcast, because that leads to the worst comedy. Alright, here we go. Push me, push you. Hey, look, Ogre gets a block here. Three dice. Two dice. He he's got dice. Oh, right, you don't have guard. Oh, well, never mind. It's a solid push away. That's fair. Ah, uh, now you can see, moving on along here, yeah, they might not even have to get him. If they're lucky, you can eliminate his own team. At least that's the plan, I think. The way these dice are. Ah, uh, there we go. Blitzes away. Solid hit. That's a good punch right into the chin there. And he got him. Hell yeah! Yeah, he got him, all right. Would you like to pile on to make sure? No? No, you don't? You don't want to do that? Okay, fine, I won't suggest it then. Okay. I mean, well, the scrum continues. Big, solid hit there. So, yeah, merely the Twin Tails did come in with lots of great starts and increases in skills, but you can see the casualty war is not going their way, is it? And welcome to... Yeah, you got it. Turn three. Well, Twin Tail comments, you're going to have to change your mind. You're not going this way, Sunshine. Now, outside the ball, Kitty got involved. And yet, you see that, right? He's going against the Ogre, and he does shove him out of the way. So basically now it's time to force the score and yes indeed yeah blazing new path straight into the ground you've got that one right over the top he goes yeah you can see the plan has indeed changed he can't stall this one out it's certainly not working no really it's really not working and as you can see that is some pretty impressive casualties already here all right twin tail comet well, they're streaking along the sky somewhere. How about you? That fails first dodge, and of course, fails the second dodge. Ah! Now, why wouldn't anyone in nine that? You've seen how the rolls have been going this game. Yep, double wants it again. Yep, ladies and gentlemen, that is now already by this turn the third double one. It is absolutely bloody impressive. However, can the ball shots take advantage of that? Well, who knows? This is why we watch the games, don't we? All right, charging in. He's looking for dice here. No, he's got things all marked up. What do you mean? Yeah, he's already down, lad. You can't do any more to him. What do you mean he can foul? No, that's true, actually. Never mind. All right, gets the push. Sticks the guard in. That's what she said. Uh, now the dirty player. Well, he's not doing his job. Well, he's got to go and interfere a little bit here. There we go. Two dice. Now, nope, just a push. Yeah, Riverdale's making a hell of a scrum of this one here. And of course they fail that dodge. Stab, stab, stab. You like to try that, eh? Never mind. <laughs> you know, this has become fail ball, that blood ball. But you know what? That's half the fun of this one. Who's going to actually have the least failures and actually score this thing? That might be the real question. All right, here we go. Salty punch. There we go. We'll take the skills away so you can see how bad this has gotten already. Makes the dodge. Yeah, he's having a plan for failure. Yeah, should have shug slugged the ball here. How about this slug? Yeah, double skulls it again. Oh, God. You have failed me for the last time. Yeah, all that positioning did sweet watery all. You should have just tried to sneak that one in for the quick score, but, you know, that's not happening. And uh, now, suddenly, yeah, again, as was noted, that is now the fourth double skull of the game. And there we go, good, solid hit. Get over here! Doors only get the stun, did not follow that one up, that's because he wants to concentrate his fire here. And of course, rolls a 1 and 9, doesn't do anything with it. Well, he was his hope, anyway. Push, mate, push you here. God, what a crazy game this has become. Makes the crazy dodge. Comes in, does get there, and there's the ball carrier down. Yay! 
Ball for his feet. Guess what? He's got the ball. Damn, son. Where'd you find this? I was bouncing on the ground, so therefore he caught it in me. Well, Frenzy. Yeah, it's a juggernaut blitzer with Frenzy. And here he goes. This is the surf captain of the team. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, he is stuck standing there. He'd already moved. So, welcome to the next turn. Turn five. Twin tail. Yeah, you can hear the dodge going on. He's got to get a player in a position, and he does make it. Well done, lad. Well done. You better become a real player someday. All right, Pitachin is here. Rerolls that because he desperately needs the air. He got him. Thanks for standing still, wanker. Ball goes clearing free one more time. Yep, Twin Tail Comet's not giving this one up without a solid punch. Uh, of course, they're giving up with a good solid trip, don't they? Oh well. Absolutely, everyone's losing their balls this turn here. Yes, I can see the scissors coming out as we speak from both coaches. <laughs> They've about at it with this one. Oh well, Elgar's going to take a swing. Yep, three dice fails. Oh well, that's fine. He can guard all three of them. That's his job. Riverdale. Keeping up the pressure indeed. Yep, yeah, apparently get, you've got some cheers here. Go, Riverdale. Solid punch into the poor catcher. How are you feeling? Grass grows, birds fly, sun shines, and brother, I hurt people. Apparently you did it. Something he is well and truly bell run there. Yeah, you know what three areas is all about, don't you? You've seen enough of that. Pushes in the ball here. It has become quite the scrum here, but I want to show you who's going for possession. Now, admittedly, when you look at the skill ups here, that the Twin Tail Comets might still, they do have some with extra agility. Problem is, they might be running out of those players. Let's take a look once we get back to it. There, yeah, ding that bell there. Yeah, there we go. Here you can see. He does have high agility players, if he can actually get them on the ball. That would be the plan. Again, push me, push you, how about you? It's risky, two dice up hill, tries it again, and you see, it's a huge skull. <laughs> well, it was two red dice up hill, he's desperate to get out of this situation. Meanwhile, Riverdale continues the onslaught. Strength five, he's just having a hell of a time. Meanwhile, over here, he looks like he's going for the surf. Doesn't need it, though. Just plain ass, normal, every day, no question about it. No NFL, no year. Not named after a player, not named after a coach, not named after the referees, pet goldfish, no quarterback, dimeback, nickelback. Simple, ordinary, unembellished, unmistakable, crystal clear, as frank as Frankenstein, as blunt as an atom bomb. One compound word, it's motherfucking goddamn sons of bitchin' fuck, fuck, fucking football. <laughs> See, he sums it up so nicely, and here we go, someone's about to meet the crowd, not the way he likes it. Here we go, hello sweetheart, oh he's lucky. Yeah, it does look like they actually like that lad, oh well, shame on that one. But he does have the football, and he is off and running. And the ogre, solid punch, yeah exactly. And now here it is, it's time for the fouling as well, that was long overdue. Does he get him? That's only a stun. Crap! Yeah, I know the feeling. Alright, so what we got here? Desperation by the twin-tailed comets. They came in, this entire mutant team, and they've lost their marbles and the football while they're at it. Salty punch here. Alright, here it comes. Dodges out, makes the dodges, comes over the top here. Right into a fist. I approve. You remember he had five rerolls? Past tense. Absolutely past tense. Good lord, what a nuffling game. And there he goes, he is off with the ball and he is running. Run, bitch! Run! Rest of the team on the move here. Yeah, they're gonna move up and try and foul the next one. Why well, that it works, so they're gonna go trouser this one. And by trouser, I mean hit. And by hit, I mean sticks things in. That is the plan anyway. Oh dear, Bonehead, he's on face no more on that one. And here we go, another solid hit. Does he get a result? No, can't expect results every time. But indeed, yeah, I think we sense a boot in your future, lad. Meanwhile, over here, 
pulls it on here. Comes in, gets just the push. Rerolls that because he's got like better to do two rerolls. Still only gets a push. Yeah, that's fine. It's an 85 catcher. You don't blame him. Oh dear. Boot one more time. Does he get the result he wants? And it's still nothing. Crap. Yeah, well, can't get everything. Yeah, he's definitely looking at pick of Betty, isn't he? There we go. It's only a stun, though, admittedly. And meanwhile, he's going to keep begging back to work here. Yeah, you're starting to see that, right? A lot of one dice. He's got nothing of a job. Tries it. Almost made it, too. Me, me. Makes the hard dodge. Fails the easy one. Oh, well, you know what that means? It is a score. One nil. And that is your half time. Riverdale is up one to nil. Absolute insanity there. Absolute insanity this halftime. Of course, it's brought to you by Cord's Dead Ucker Removal. Yes, clean, discreet, no questions asked. Because how else are you getting those light bulbs in the basement change? Cord's Dead Ucker Removal. All right, lads, let's get back on the ball there. Now, here's the fun part. Twin Tails are on the defense this time. Now, taking a look here, he only had the one reserve. He is out for an injury there. That is the double AG Blitzer. He is out. And the KO, of course, on the Star Thrower. Meanwhile, take a look over here. Notice nothing. Absolutely nothing. Now, many of you would all say, well, that means he's going to win. Well, we all know how well that prediction normally works. And you do look at it. It is quite an impressive amount of skill ops. It really is. Especially start upgrades. Double agility here. Double strength here. This man can one man get in there and steal the balls. He's going to steal some balls there. Oh, I understand he's got a briss. Look that one up. All right, Riverdale though. Up 1-0. They are feeling pretty confident here. At least so is the theory anyway. Could all go possibly wrong. That is easily possible. This is, of course, Exchange. Exchange is well known for horrendous casualty totals. Some of the games I cast early on last month, you saw how brutal those got. All right, here we go. There's solid kick. It's time for the pitch invasion. <laughs> Crowd does a number, indeed, including the receiver is down. There is no one to get this thing. Suddenly, Twin Tail are back in this game. And now he's here to f us. Oh well, he's dead. Yeah. Pothecary goes in, and yes, he's still dead. <laughs> well, we all know what that means, yeah. Fuck you. All right. Yes. Death into a death on the casualty. Perfect 67 67. Oh well, beautiful. Beautiful indeed. Oh well, who needed the play anyway? There we go. Another one's gone. So sure you can defeat me. Well, he is trying to defeat him, all right. See, there's your death. As promised, you got your body. Well, it truly ogred. Or is that Roger? No, it's no good. Roger's something else. But as you can see here, Riverdale does have to run back and try to recover the ball. Which, of course, he fails. Message for you, sir. All right, Twin-Tailed Comet. It is a complete disaster. It's now going to take complete and utter aggression here to try and get right back into this game. And he got him! Yeah, indeed, he did get him. Finally, Strike 5 comes through, and now here it comes. All the pressure. Yeah, here it comes, all right. He's breathing heavy. I can hear him from here. Ah, uh, he's putting everything he's got in there, plus a bag of crisp. He needs to steal this ball. Yeah, everything here. Twin Tail came to play. They know this is the playoffs. Whoever loses this game is eliminated. So, yes, it really is sudden death for somebody. Especially this one. <laughs> that fails that one there. Nope, not trying that again. He figured that was one too many pushes. 
Well, that's about as far as he was going to get. All right, Riverdale. Well, it's not a sure thing yet here. And yes, they're back and running. they got to take care of this long surge. And they still have to pick up a football. It's still not a sure thing. All right, Riverdale moving into position here. Try to protect this one here. Of course, you can't resist the pile on Mighty Blow, which, of course, fails. Well, that's what you get when you get a little cocky. We've seen how this game's going. Nothing's going right for either team. All right, Rod's back. Go get his balls. Yes, he does have it. Let's hear it for AG increase. There's the easy pass. Run away! Run away! Run away! Well, uh, as you can see there, he did indeed run away. And he fails the block over there, unfortunately. Ball is in a great position here for Riverdale, but this is recoverable. What can the Twin Tail Comets do about that one? Well, that's what we tuned in to find out, and off they go. They're already down two players on this drive here, so it's going to be a tough one. It is nine defending 11. Twin Tail. Zipping around here. Gob storming in. Just a quick push. That's all he needs. He's trying to free up this player to get him into the action here. And indeed, there he goes. Yeah, it might all come down to this one player doing all the work. I approve. And you can see, this is risk is the business here. He is putting everything he's got in. Try and steal this one back. Now he stormed everything in here. He's hoping to get a cheeky on one there. He does indeed. How are you feeling? Yeah, he's a bit of alright, I guess. Makes the quick dodge away there. Yeah, he finangled everything that turn. That was what Twin Tail needed to try and stay in this game. Riverdale. Alright, on the move. Well, they got to clean this mess up here. Two dice just gets a push. Well, that's all he needed for now. Yeah, he's looking for the surf later. At least he's helping. Oh dear. Yeah, he's got it. Frenzy comes running in. Unfortunately, it's only a block. Guess what? That's what Juggernaut's for. Fuck you. And here he goes. Goodbye. Shenanigans! 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 That's why he's got Juggernaut. You're all wondering why. That's why. Oh god. Message for you, sir. Well, you didn't need that reroll anyway. And there we go. Trips himself up there. Two dice. Double skulls it! And get off my lawn! Unfortunately, he does actually get his ball back. Oh my lord, what is with this game today? Yeah, it's pretty much summing it up right now. Alright, suddenly, right into the strength. There's a solid punch. Ball goes flying. Oh no, not the ogre. No, he's got the ball. What's he going to do with it? He's moved. Oh, fuck. Well, that wasn't planned. Oh well. It's going to make a new plan. Absolutely a new plan. Here we go. Twin Tails. Pouring it on. Can they get something? Well, they knocked him away. <sighs> I approve. Yeah, we do approve indeed. There is solid punching going on. But no more casually. Oh, you saw that. Skulls it. Fallen boy. Yeah, you saw it. Another skull. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Gosh, that is now how many double skulls? Six for this game? Oh god, hell of a time for a bonehead. Well, that settles that problem. Block on block. Oh good lord, this is going to become a full on scrum, isn't it? Double skulls, there's seven. Just gets the push though. Good lord. But the frenzy kicks in. Yeah, it's another push. Riverdale. I don't think they know what's going on here. It's just the dice are absolutely atrocious for either team. Take the skills off. You can see how much of a mess this has become. Oh, but yeah, that's number eight. Oh, God. Nine, 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 nine. Cheerleaders are making a mockery. Yeah, objection. That's eight double skulls for this game. What was this about it being a 136? Eight fucking times this game. Eight times. It's been about equal. Both teams have done it four times. Yeah, just look at it. All the double skulls. It's absolutely genius. Twin Tail Comets fighting back. It's not over to the family dies. And nope, Sid's not coming out for this one. 
At least so's the rumor. All right, he's just trying to make a way through and he can't get out of here. Well, he's got a dodge route now. Two dice, finally gets a solid hit. That's what he was looking for. Uh, run, you little bastard, run. He makes it. Do it! Runs over here to join in the escapade. There's the cheeky handoff. He makes it. And he's running. And his name is Panda. Yeah, you see that, right? River. Dale cannot catch this one unless they get absolutely crazy. The twin tail might be tying this one up. And yes, it might be sudden death. And again on the cell phone, looking it up. Get off her face now, you prat. Oh well, he's got to put the pressure on there. Riverdale on the move here, trying to stop this one. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be solid fistings all up and down the lane here. There we go, solid push. That's all he's getting on that one. And now the runaway, or maybe not. Now he's going to make it a scrum. He figures, let's force it to overtime. There's the frenzy. Well, he's certainly going to prevent him from stalling. Otherwise, goodbye, sweetheart. Does make the dodge, though. Good lord, does he make the markup? Yes, he does. It's not over yet, is it? Good lord, there we go. Solid hit. Knocks that lad down. Well, you're going to have to clear this mess up. At least so's the theory. Moves on in. He makes the cheeky dodge. Well, of course he does. He's AG5. Well done, makes it all, and there's the score, tied up, 1-2-1. One, one. What a fight this is becoming. Good lord, big plays. Absolutely, it's down to Riverdale. He's got three turns to drive this one back. Absolutely incredible here. Three turns for Riverdale to try and put this one away. Remember, it is whoever wins goes on further in the playoffs for the exchange. Otherwise, it is elimination. Taking a look here. Pothgetty is indeed gone. He still has the Pothgetty on the Riverdales. Now, in case he gets a real injury, is his feeling here. Yeah? Now, yeah, just in case, asking for a friend there. All right, Rivendale. Got to consider this one pretty carefully. Yeah, three thirds. It is an easy score if they do it. Well, at least that's the 30 anyway. All right, right. Let's see what we got on this kick here. Here we go. It's an on site kick. Perfect defense. And his name is John C. Yeah, it is a perfect kick with a perfect defense. All of a sudden, Twin Tail Comets, they get just a bounce the right way. This game is completely in trouble. Yeah, I do, exp I do believe they are elves. At least that's the rumor. I think they drink elves' blood, though. There's some kind of secret ritual. Apparently involving Jughead. At least that's what I was told. Good lord, lucky bounce right into the blitz of a juggernaut. And they're right on his way. He isn't dead. Try surprise. I know he's not dead. It is a surprise there, the way this game's going. But indeed, that is a sweet, sweet KO. And that once again puts it to 11 on 9. And this time, Rivendale is on the offense. All right, let's see if the Ogre can tough it off this time. Nope. Comes in for the mark. That is his job. What's this? It's a cage? Look of fear and surprise. What's this thing? It's a cage. We're actually going to see one of those today. Well, how are you feeling? Yes, yeah, so I know. He's just stunned. Lucky you, isn't he? All right, moves a couple more players here. He does see we could do a load of pain. Lots and lots of pain. But yes, indeed, he does have a cage up. It's a miracle this day. Push me, push you here. The scrum is continuing here. Meanwhile, bit of action going on here on the sidelines here. Do we get something? 
Yeah, he's working on I it. Broke your stupid crap, moron. Yeah, he's trying to break it, but it's not breaking enough, is it? Charges up here with the extra guard. Is he going to take? Yeah, he does. Does get it, but does he get the removal? Almost. Finish her. It's making it a bit of a mockery of this year. Yeah, it was looking good for the Twin Tail Comets, but that is an awful lot of stunning. Yep, three stuns and a KO. That was a horrible turn. But it is the playoffs. This is the final game near the finals here. So he's going to put up the fight he scored. This is his big problem right now. This bugger who can take this on solo is all the way over here. Just because of the lucky bounce. Alright, what's he got left? It's a good question here. Twin Tail Comets, they are still scrumming this here. But it's got to be all focused. They've got to go get the ball. Y they can't ignore it this time. Remember, if it's a tie, we go to overtime. And then suddenly rerolls get really important here. And Rivendale's already down to. So far, Twin Tails kept all his rerolls this half. Alright, here we go. Solid push on the front line here. Is he going to risk it? It's a good question. Three dice. Oh, good lord. Solid hit on the catcher. He's alive. That's saying something. Now he's got everything marked up. Best he can here. Yeah, is he going to press for the score? Yeah, it looks like he is indeed looking for the score here. His rest of his lads are on the move. Trying to prevent any counterattack. I think he's got a plan there. It looks like I suspect it's going to be a handoff. More dice being thrown here. Push me, push you. Well, Twin Tail can still stop this one, but it's going to be a tough one. Here he comes. And he's in front. There's the handoff. Of course he fails. How could this happen? Ray rolls it though. It does get away. But now he's down to one Ray roll. If this fails, overtime might not look too good. And more dodging. He's just not getting these players down here. He shoved them away. But it's all going to come down to this one defensive play here. Meanwhile, all the risk, all the business, and of course, all the fail. Ah, uh, who called the cops? And here we are. This is the turn that's going to decide this game, probably. Turn 15. He cannot leave him standing. He's got dodge and AG, so he has to knock this player down. This is a non-ignore. Moves on here. Go to your potato. Team Potato. Go, Kevin Potato. All right. Solid it. He does get the KO. I hope you die from hugs. Killer hugs for everyone. Yeah, he does indeed get the KO here. You can see the desperation now. He's got two players freed up. This is how crazy this is about to get here. Yeah, comes around over the top. Goes for two. And he actually makes the three. Yes, he made three. This is it, ladies and gentlemen. This is it. Going for the two dice block. One die. Now yeah, it's only a dodge. And you fail. That was about the best he figured he could do there. But here we go. Rivendale. Frenzy. Trying to clear the play away. Uh, that's not what he wanted. Block on block. But he does make the dodge. That is it. It is in. Two to one. Yep, you can hear it, the Rivendale fans. They're going on, they can cheer it, they can feel it. Alright, someone shut them off, alright. But you can hear them in the background, they are definitely out, it. they think this is it. Now, let's take a look here, what is left for the Twin Dale? Twin Tails, Twin Dales? Mikhail, I don't care. Well, you can see they did fully get a removal, but this is starting to become a problem here. There is still reserves, still a full 11 players. As you can see, Rivendale are setting up here, preparing for just about everything. Meanwhile, as you can see, lots and lots of options here. 
He's going to have to get very creative, but indeed. What do you mean they never treat? They can't get to the game in time. That's why there's never a tree in the spectators. They never get there in time. By the time they enter, the game's over. I swear, it's true. God, what a game they've put on today. It is still possible. He has all three of his rerolls. Funny this, he's got three rerolls here. Can he make a wooded touchdown? This is where Crazy gets on the bus. Absolutely. All full on. Crazy has got to get on the bus. He's got to find a way. Especially this one. This is the player that's probably going to do it here. Get him into range and score it. The other option he's got is this player because he has the movement increase. Movement 9. Alright, here we go. There's the kick. Alright, kick off return. Go find the ball. What have you got today for this? Oh, it's a free re-roll. Hey, that's pretty good. Not that they need it, unless it goes to overtime. Ball does bounce. Okay, here we go. All the marbles are on this one. Alright, step one. He's gotten himself just a push. Absolutely not what he needs. No, this might have toughed it. Oh, well, he took him down. That is a KO, but that is a disaster. That does not fit in with the plan here. I think that is it. I think indeed that will be it. And of course he fails the pass of all things. And you can hear it. They're celebrating. Riverdale is moving on. 2-1 to one is your final score. Team Mutation goes down. Heads hung in shame. But they will return Season 3. They do promise. Oh, what a game. Anyway... Oh, they're not going to shut up for a while, are they? Anyway, it is a triple header. Our final game of the night, AD Invitational. We will see you all shortly. Time for another beer. Nuffle, bless your dice.